Now, Northwest News Evening Edition. Well, it's been said that you shouldn't judge a book by its cover, but many customers often buy wine because of its label. And now one Northwest company is taking wine design to a whole new level. Photojournalist Daniel Foy has more on how bottles of wine can become works of art. Uh, the name of the company is Fresh Northwest Design. We are a company that etches and hand paints wine bottles. But many consumers uh, will purchase based on what the label looks like. So for us, um, in providing something that's so handcrafted, it can really give a winery in particular an opportunity to stand out and above uh, and outside the rest. So basically we take uh, either empty bottles or full bottles and we uh, work up artwork either that the client has or an inspiration that they have and uh, create a vellum that acts as a mask we, that we uh, affix to the bottle. And that mask allows us to uh, use a sandblaster to uh, basically give the 3D effect. The rest of the bottle we cover with uh, masking tape and that masking tape protects the integrity of the remainder of the bottle so that it's not uh, blasted, if you will, by sand uh, and still remains perfectly smooth. Right there, that's your finished product. That's what goes in the sandblaster. Um, where we can, we will try to lay down uh, base colors via airbrush. Uh, and then do any uh, detail via hand paint. All the bottles will be hand painted. They're all hand painted individually. There's no, uh, most people think that we just run this through a machine and we actually don't. Everything is done by hand. It's a very, very, very archaic process. Today, this probably took about two hours, but I've take, done one that's taken up to two weeks before. So it really varies depending on the complexity of the art. Then we'll use a razor blade on each bottle very carefully to remove all excess paint um, and any other materials. It, it makes it special. It makes it, it goes from just being a bottle that perhaps could have, have a beautiful label to really being a piece of art. Some of those bottles will be on display at the Washington Wine Festival in Seattle through April 13th. You can also find out more about that company by visiting our website, that's nwcn.com. Just click on the Wine Design News Link.